Hey guys, I've done a pretty horrible job at keeping you updated with what's going on as it's happening. So today I'm going to try to be a little bit better. I just got ready, did a quick little shower, threw on some clothes. No makeup today because I have some fun stuff planned with Jolene. So Jolene is on her way here from Baltimore. We're gonna go shopping. I haven't eaten yet, so I want to get some lunch and I'm looking out, looking for some different spots where I might be able to go right now. Either I'll just like walk around and see what is around or I might try to go to one of these Vietnamese restaurants that I found. And then we're gonna go shopping. We're shopping in downtown and then I think we're gonna go up to Georgetown. We're gonna shop around there. Um, may pop in to see Will. I'm gonna check my find my friends and see where he is because I don't remember how to get to his job. But we're gonna surprise him, maybe. And then, or I might just meet up with him tomorrow. Julian and I are supposed to be going to get some facials. So no makeup or anything because I wanna make sure my face is like as clean, whatever, before the facial. And then maybe we'll get dinner. Stefan should be done with work and his work stuff by 8. It's been a pretty productive day so far. I haven't been showing you guys like since St. Croix. I haven't showed you any like work related stuff. But I have been working. So like this is vacation kind of. But it's more just like I'm working remotely. I've been still doing, keeping up with my social posts, um, communicating with clients. I actually just closed out um, a contract with a client this morning. And I started a new contract with another client last week. So things are moving along. I mean, I have to give you guys like a full rundown, but right now I have one full-time client and I have one short-term client. Things are still pretty good. Uh, money's still coming in. That's all that matters. <laughs> I'm happy. I'm less stressed. I'm sitting down because my legs are cramping. I went to the gym yesterday with Stefan. You guys have seen, I think. I did not. Maybe I didn't bring you on the vlog, but if you've been keeping up with my Instagram stories, then you're literally getting a play-by-play -play of what's been happening while I've been traveling. And I'm really sorry that I have not like just sat down somewhere to just edit my videos but I am really just enjoying my time and I will get to it and you guys will have a lot of really good content to watch. So these are my last few days in DC before I head up to New York uh, for my five year college reunion. It's been really nice being here. Like my heart feels so full. I've been seeing so many people that I haven't seen in such a long time and just catching up and having a really good time. This past weekend, Memorial Weekend was perfect like I literally could not have asked for anything better I'm really happy that I did make the decision to come to DC before going up to my reunion so yeah I'm just waiting for Julian to let me know where she is and we will head on the road Lots of my college vlogs, um, but we're in this little farmer's market thing. We're gonna walk around, see what they have. We were just trying on a whole bunch of scented moisturizers because I ordered the wrong shade and now I have the right shade. Or at least I hope so. Tell me if this looks good. In DC, and you said that you go to that place, they're like, oh my god, you went to that place? <laughs> so, we can go there. Okay. <laughs> Julian and I have been shopping all day and the only thing that we bought <laughs> was at Sephora. 
We went to Zara, Express, Express and H&M. Nothing. And finished, well, Macy's, finished line in Macy's and that was a flop. Yeah, and only reason I didn't get anything at Zara was because their fitting rooms were closed. So we're going to the one in Georgetown so we can hopefully try on some clothes and buy some stuff. <laughs> facial ever. Jolene has been here multiple times. My favorite part of the day. <laughs> yeah. So I'm very excited to get my first facial. We got drinks before this. We went to <laughs> Fig and Olive and it was really good. We had a couple drinks. So we are feeling relaxed and ready and we're going inside now. pretty chill day I have been using today to recover from the past few days of just being up and about and doing a lot of stuff so it is currently 3 or 5 p.m. my plan for today is to head into Georgetown I want to see if I can find some stores to shop at to see if I can get some stuff for reunion 
If I don't, it's fine. I have backup outfits in my suitcase. But I really hope that I find something new and cute that fits and that I can actually try out in store. So that's what I'm doing. And then I want to meet up with Will. I did not get to surprise him yesterday, but I'm gonna meet up with Will after he gets out of work. Uh, we're probably gonna get dinner and then just hang out and catch up. Yesterday, I did some shopping at Sephora and I wanted to do a haul because you all have been requesting hauls, especially when it comes to like my skincare, makeup, and my hair um, routine, the products that I use. So I'm just gonna show you a few things that I picked up yesterday. The first thing is this NARS Tinted Moisturizer. Um, I actually bought this twice already in the past. I bought them from Ulta, but I had never tried it before. I wasn't sure about my... I wasn't sure if I got the right color. It, the one that I got that I was using was pretty light. I'll put the name down here so that you know. So it was like a little bit too light, a little bit too ashy. And then I reordered the darker color to that one. But then when I was here, I was like, I'm in support anyway. Let me just try them out and see which one actually looks the best. So I put this one on in store and I think it looks pretty good. I think especially now that I'm a little bit more tan, it's like a little bit more... Like it looks good on camera, I think, but when I was looking at it in different lights and it looked like my face was like a tiny bit darker than like the rest of my body, but I think this will be good, especially for summertime that I'll be out and about like outside in the sun. And the good thing about it too is that it has SPF 30 in there, so don't have to worry too much about sunscreen. The next thing that I got is my try to true favorite, the Ola Henriksen Glow 2 OH Dark Spot Toner. I've used this, you guys know, I've emptied bottles of this. I even got the giant limited edition one, finished that, so got a re-up of that. Next thing is this one, a cult favorite. Everybody loves this. I decided I'd finally try it out. It's the Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask. I have it on my lips right now. I wore it last night to bed and I think it lives up to the hype. It's very moisturizing and I love it. And now that I started buying it, I'll probably not be able to control myself. I need to buy it constantly going forward. The last thing that I got was the smaller size of the Pharmacy Honey Halo. So it's just a moisturizer, but it's also another one of those things that everybody just talks about constantly. So I guess I'll show you what it looks like on the inside. I've already used these, this one as well. So you can see what that looks like. It's also very moisturizing and a little bit goes a long way, which I like because the big Sorry about that. Yeah, the big one is actually pretty expensive. So um, this one was just like $22 or something like that. So I'm happy that I got the small one. Um, I'll get a good bit of time to try that out. And if I really still love it by the end of the time, then I will um, repurchase. This is what the lip mask looks like. I'm sure most of you probably already know. I'm the one that's late on the game for this one. There you go. See? That's how much I used between last night and this morning. So yeah, those are the things that I got from Sephora yesterday. I'm gonna go back into Sephora again today. Stefan wants me to get some stuff, choose out some like skincare stuff for his mom. And yeah, I'm gonna take you guys around Georgetown. I really like Georgetown. Um, I had some really good food around the area. I haven't eaten yet for the day and it's three o'clock, so I'll probably end up getting some food around that area too, maybe, if I feel like it. But then again, I want to meet up with Will for dinner, so I don't wanna be too full for that. So yeah, let's go. Let's go enjoy our day. Hope you guys are having a great day. Make sure you subscribe and let's go. So I'm in H&M right now in the fitting room. I picked up these things. We'll see if any of them fit me. Let's try them on. Back outside, I went into Aritzia. There were some things that I liked, not many sizes that would actually fit me. Prices were expensive, so I didn't get anything. Still not that great of a shopping day, but it's better than before. I'm really upset because Baked and Wired is closed. I came all the way here and they closed up four. Sorry, I'm vlogging. <laughs> and I'm sweaty and I'm hot. Look who I'm with. It's William. You guys remember? I'll put oh, up. Wow. Yeah, I know it's been a long time, two years. But 
I'll link the last time we were together so you guys can see. I was in the vlog uh, five years ago, actually. Five years? Like at yeah, school? Like at school, yeah. Oh, yeah. And then all the times I came to visit you. Yes, yes, yeah. that too. He's a star. <laughs> um, we are going to an Italian restaurant. You know the name? Avolo. Avolo. And I'm starving. This is the first time I'm eating today, actually. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. 